hello dear i think you all are fine at your home and myself nutra nimalik welcome you all to the digital class today i am going to teach classic english that is hani sakal and today we will read the first chapter of the hani sakal book so before going to the chapter i want to ask you something so dear have you got homework from your school yes i think you have got because i not i do not think i know because we are giving the homework to you and what uh, what is uh, uh, the opinion about the homework which you are given i think almost all of you do not like homework but my dear students homework is essential for us because by the homework we can show our inner quality our understanding our skill of writing okay these all things we show by the by giving the homework regularly and also we are clear we we are we we clear the uh, chapter by giving the homework so here is a uh, sub chapter which is about the homework of a little children little child so the child name is patrick and the chapter name is who did patrick's homework dear students before listening to you please uh, go through the chapter clearly and uh, for which you can understand clearly okay start the first chapter open open your book first chapter okay okay first paragraph patrick never did homework who boring he said he played hockey basketball nintendo instead his teacher told him patrick do your homework or you won't learn a thing and it is so it is true sometimes he feel like an ignoramus but what could he do he had a homework patrick never did his homework at all and said too boring homework are too boring okay instead of uh, uh, doing the homework he played football basketball okay nintendo hockey like this nintendo is a video game remember that and sometimes he feel ignoramus ignoramus means ignore because the teachers uh, advised him again and again to do the homework do the homework do the homework but he do not uh, do that so that the, he fail ignoramus because all the students gave their uh, homework regularly except uh, patrick but what could he do he had to homework okay so uh, he cannot do, he could not do anything because he had the homework okay in the second paragraph then one day he found his cat playing with a little doll and he grabbed it away then one day he found patrick found his cat was playing with a little doll and grabbed it away patrick grabbed it away to his surprise it was not at all he grabbed it away from the cat but he found that it was not a doll what was that it was a man of the teenage size he had a little wool shirt with old fashion breeches breeches means a short pant and a high tall hat much like with okay he had a high hat also on his head okay at that time he yelled elt save me do not give me back to that cat i will grant you a wish i promise you that so 
he held held means request by joining his hands he request that uh, uh, what save me do not give me back to that cat i will grant you a wish i promise you so patrick was uh, what searching for uh, this time he wants a wish he he, he wanted a wish that uh, if anyone could give him a wish what was the wish thought yourself i will uh, i will say you yes so patrick could not believe how lucky he was he wa here was the answer to all his problems the promise was the answer of uh, all the problems of patrick so he said only if you do all my homework till the end of the semester that is 35 days if you can do my homework till the end of this semester and which is 35 days uh, after the uh, after that day i could even get as as means grade okay the little man's face wrinkled like a discloth thrown in the hamper okay the little man discloth means uh, uh, discloth wrinkle means uh, become what is that uh, become uh, squeeze okay and he discloth uh, like uh, um, in, uh, what is that a uh, 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 the cloth which when washed after was after washed it uh, uh, what kept in it is kept in the basket like that his face became he kicked his legs and doubled his fists he kicked his legs in the uh, floor and uh, doubled his fists and he grimaced and scowled and pursed his lips oh i am cursed but i will do it he kicked his legs and uh, doubled his fist and he grimaced grimaced means right students grimaced scowled pursed his lips his uh, face had these are some expressions expressions showing disgust or uh, anger or disapproval he has no uh, way to deny so he was doing this expressions and said oh am i cost but i have to do it i have to do it but he had to do the homework so dear students for today this much four paragraphs in the next class we will read the next paragraphs only there are five paragraphs six paragraphs left that will be read in the next next class till then be safe be happy have a nice day Thank you